What is going on guys? Welcome back to the channel. Panthers advice today. We're taking a look at one of the fastest, youngest safeties in the NFL. His name is Jeremy Chin. Man, let's just jump into the clip. So right here, Panthers are going to sit in the zone. Watch how fast he reacts once Winston throws his ball. Boom. And it's not so much once Winston throws the ball. is once he looks at the screen because that's not his first read. His first read is to look at the slot receiver, right? Once that's not open, he's going to check it down. Chin's going to see that. Boom. He collapses right there. That closeout speed is crazy. Let's jump to the next one. All right, guys, there's a couple things to watch on this play, but we're going to let it run real time. Just focus on Chin coming up to the line of scrimmage right here. So take a look. Chin's going to come up. They're going to send Alave in motion. All right. Winston's going to look that way, and boom. Now, in theory, this play should have worked, right? So like we talked about before, bam, the Panthers bring Chin up. Okay, Saints see that. They're like, all right, we're going to take our chances. Chris Alave one-on-one with anybody in the league, basically. We'll take it. So they bring him in motion. If Chin blitzes, man, Chris Alave is going to come, and that's exactly what they want. That's one thing to focus on. The next thing is, bam, this tackle is actually going to peel out, and they have running back help. This is going to give Winston time to throw that ball. But you're going to see Chin sees that. So next thing he does is, bam, he prepares to swat it down. So instead of coming in to try and fight through the tackle of the running back, he positions himself in a way to swat the ball down, as you're going to see. Boom. Like I said, his closeout speed is crazy, and his vision also amazing, too. Good stuff. Let's jump to the next one. All right, guys, right here we got Chin lined up on the edge. The thing that sticks out to me right here is he has that second, third gear. So he's already moving quick, and then boom. That's speed you can't teach right there. Coming on that edge. Boom, good play right there. All right, guys, right here we got Chin. He's going to creep up right here. Safety's going to move over, as you're going to see. We're going to let it run, go over it after. Chin creeps up. Once again, look what he's going to do. Another swatted pass. People worried about Bryce Young getting his pass to swat it. This isn't one game. That's two swatted passes from Chin alone, man. All right, guys, on this play we got Chin lined up in the box. Seahawks are going to run a read option. Chin's going to be right there. Great run support. Doesn't overreact one way or another whether Gino keeps it or he hands it off. Good stuff right there, man. Let's jump to the next one. All right, guys. On this play, we got Chin up here. Creep it down to safety once again. Seahawks are going to run a toss this way. Now, they're going to get blockers out in front, but take a look at what Chin does right here. Boom. They run the toss. Get blockers out in front. Boom. Chin's right there to help out, man. As you see, Chin's going to come down. Create leverage with this guy by pushing him right there. Boom. Now he can't engage with Chin. He's created that separation. Next thing he does, go after that running back. Great play right there. All right, guys, on this play, we got Chin. Man-to-man -man coverage guarding the out route right here. Bam. Let's take a look. We'll go over it after. Gino drops back. Boom. Closeout speed once again. No pass interference. He's right there. Easy swat of ball. Take a look again. Boom. Receiver runs that out route. Chin's right there breaking that ball up. Great play. Again, great closeout speed right there. Let's keep it going. Man-to-man -man coverage so far. Not too shabby. All right, as you guys know, in my reviews, I keep it a buck. Show the good and the bad as well. So right here, we're going to see Chin man-to-man -man coverage against Deontay Johnson. And before I run this play, I want you to watch how Deontay runs this route before he jumps back to the outside. So let's take a look. Comes back in. Boom. Bounces it out. Chin gets beat. Eight. But he doesn't allow that many yards after the catch. So take a look again. Watch Deontay. He's going to bounce it to the outside. Chin commits that way. And he goes, boom. Cuts it right back in. A good play, but the important thing is Chin, he allowed the catch, but not that many yards after. Let's go to the next one. On this play, we got Chin in the box once again. Now watch how the Steelers run this. We're going to go over it after, so take a look. He doesn't get sucked in. That's the important thing to watch right there. Because Steelers, in theory, pretty good run blocking right there. So take a look. This guard's going to pull over here. they got a tight end set up on the edge right there. As you're going to see, the center's going to come out. Guard's going to pull right there. Got the tackle right there and the tight end. Chin's not going to get sucked in by either one. See Chin's right there. He's watching the play, making sure it doesn't get past him. Boom, boom, boom. And then when he reacts, man, game over. Jump to the next one. All right, on this play, we got Chin right here. Once again, I want you to watch that awareness. He's watching the quarterback, watching the quarterback, watching the receiver. Bam. So once the QB gets it, boom, he's immediately looking on that outside target. He's not even looking at this guy. So I tell his Chin, man, all right, I know exactly where to go. Now, next thing you're going to see is Chin's going to look at the outside receiver, see him stop. The is going to direct his focus back to the QB. Boom. Doesn't even look back at the receiver. As you're going to see, he's going to look at the receiver for a second. Okay, I know where he is. Boom. I know exactly where that ball is going. So he went from looking at the QB. All right, looking at the outside read. Look to the receiver. Back to the QB. Boom. That's crazy. Good stuff right there. All right, guys. Right here, a little something special. Now, 
Not for Chen, but for the receiver, DJ Chark. This was last year, so this was recent. Take a look at this catch right here. He's going to be right here. One-on-one -on -one with Chen. Take a look. Goff's going to drop back. Throws it up to DJ right there. Boom. That's a hell of a catch right there. Chen, I don't know that he could have played any better defense. That's a great catch. Take a look at this again from the jump. As you're going to see, this DB is going to pick up this receiver right here, which means Chark is going to get that one-on-one -on -one with Chen right there. Goff throws it up. Hey, it's one-on-one, -on -one, mono -y mono and Chark makes a hell of a catch. So, if you were sleeping on Chark and didn't think he was that good, eh, this gives you a little something-something to go with. So, let's jump to the next one. All right, guys, later in that same game right here, once again, another out route they're going to try and run on Chen. He's going to be right here. Take a look at this play. Goff's going to drop back. Boom. And look who's swatting it away. Good stuff right there. Let's break it down real quick. We got Chen right here. Now watch how he plays this. He's got safety help over the top. Watching the QB, watching the QB. Now, the problem is the receiver doesn't sell this at all. So once this receiver cuts, boom, Chen was still watching the QB. That just gave it away. So now Chen knows, oh, bang, bang. I know exactly what's coming. Take a look. Boom. Like I said before, he was watching the QB. That receiver's going to cut. Oh, that tells Chen exactly what it is. Chen's going to cut on it. Boom. Great defense right there. All right, on this play, nothing special right here. Receiver's going to run a good move. Take a look. Andy Dalton's actually going to throw it. Hey, he gets Chen for a second, right? So take a look. He's going to come up. He's going to cut. Chen's going to bite on that for a second. Once he catches that at the 43, no more yards. Receiver's going to run a great route. Catches Chen off guard for a second. Tackles him right there. Good stuff. All right, guys. Right here is going to be the last play. We're going to break it down after. We're going to let it run. You got Chen up there. Let's take a look what happens here. Andy Dalton at QB. Looking, looking, looking. Doesn't see anything. Rolls out. Sees the receiver potentially open. Nope. Once again, man. Chen with that closeout speed. Now watch what he does here. So as we let this play develop, we see Panthers immediately cover two. Right here, everything's picked up. You got this defender guarding him. You got this defender playing the flat. Picking up Taysom Hill. The only way this gets open is if this receiver goes boom, boom, cuts right there. Because he's going to have to choose, does he go to the flat or does he go up here? But as you're going to see, this is what I was talking about with Chen, how he's always watching the QB. So take a look as this play develops. Dalton's going to roll out, boom. Once he rolls out, man, he's immediately staring right at his target. And look who's coming down with that closeout speed right there, baby. Mr. Chen himself, boom. He's always watching the quarterback. And with that speed, man, that makes him so dangerous. Let me know what you guys think of Jeremy Chen. Obviously, at the line of scrimmage, this dude is a beast. Along with Brian Burns up there, you put him in zone coverage, he's a beast as well. Let me know what you guys think. Panthers advice is out. I'll catch you guys on the next one.